I see. Anyway, Cody, I can't believe you wouldn't bring your camera on a trip to the studios. You did what bring it, it, didn't you? Tell me, what is it? What is it? Um. Objection! No! I called it the first. The judge has an objection. <laughs> what is this digital camera? Shut up, judge, I have an objection. Fine. Mr. Wright. Oh, sorry. Mr. Wright. How cruel you are to terrorize a poor child. Oh, so, thank you, but I don't care if he's a child or a prosecuting child attorney. Wants... No one should lie in court. What do you mean? Or a prosecuting attorney. You know full well, good sir. But well, Cody? Uh, what? what? Yeah, so I had my camera. So what? You got a problem with that? Slam, shut up, crowd. So, did you have a camera? Well, we just answered that. And did you use this camera? I wouldn't use it. I, I was too busy watching. Hmm, very well. Please testify to the court about what you were so busy watching. Hooray. <laughs> what I what saw. I saw. Too late. Fine. Yeah, I have my camera with me, but I was glued to the action. I couldn't take my eyes off it, fool. The steel samurai, he goes for the bad guy. Wham! Then, then the bad guy stops moving. He's so strong, the steel samurai rules. Hmm. Ah, is that all? Well, that was brief. Mr. Wright, you, your cross-examination. But of course. dun 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 Dun, 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 so, dun, statement dun. four, then, then the bad guy stops moving, and press that statement. Hold it! Why? Huh? <laughs> what do you mean, why? You know it was an XYZ, but why wasn't the bad guy moving? Be well, cause the Steel Samurai brought him to justice. And how exactly did he do that? He took him to the coffee shop! How did he do that? With a samurai kick and a punch and a samurai chop and a samurai slap. Samurai sissy fight. Samurai slap, you say? Shut up, judge! Something like that. He's still Poor being judge. vague about this. What? Don't give me that look, Pops. <laughs> How should It'd be I funny play if he's pottering Pops? Press him harder. Cody. What? what Dad? Pops? Something's bothering me. Before you said Daddy? that you couldn't take your eyes off the action. Y yeah? So what? Yet you missed the most important part? OBJECTION! What is the meaning of this? The witness has stated what he saw quite clearly. OBJECTION! Ob OBJECTION! Go away, Judge. <laughs> you know as well as I do that he's being vague. Tell me, what kind of murderer uses a samurai slap? I do. My point is this, of course you do, Judge. Cody, you may have seen some of the Steel Samurai's fight, but you missed the most important part, the killing blow. Slam, 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 slam. Order! Order! Mr. Wright, how could this be? Can you explain how he might have missed something so vital? Um, well, uh, that's the thing. Phoenix! What? I believe you're on the right track with this. Use the Celtic Guardian, Yugi. <laughs> Think. Why didn't Cody see the climax of the fight? I know you. You can't figure this out. Mr. I get her to shut up. Okay. Your answer? Go make me a sandwich. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what? What? No, you make me a sandwich. I wasn't talking to you, Judge. We have ascertained that this young boy is a great fan of the Steel Samurai. Why wouldn't he watch the climax of the fight? Show evidence. Your Honor, I have evidence. Evidence? Yes, evidence. What is this evidence? Is it like a visual camera? The fight. Once again, his camera. Take that, Judge. Here's my proof. What's that? The digital camera? The witness stated that he recently received his camera. Yes, I'm aware of that. Still don't know what it is, though. <laughs> of course not. He wasn't entirely familiar with its operation. I'm aware of that, too, because I have no idea what that button does on it. Ah! Correct. Why would Cody be looking somewhere <laughs> else at the most critical moment? Because he was looking at his camera. He was trying to take a picture. Hey! Best face ever. Seriously, that's gonna be our new icon, people. Let's do it. Bullseye! 
What, what's your problem, Pops? Got a theme for picking on a little kid? Maybe we can make that the, um, the thumbnail. Pressing, Great. not picking. <laughs> Good job, Phoenix. Did you make my sandwich? <laughs> Cody was lying, clearly. No, Miyamai does not make sandwiches. Please? Smart of you to realize there was no way he could just stand there watching his hair. I'm dead, I can't make you a sandwich. And I not a quesadilla. A... No. Right. Cody, there was only one reason why you would have looked away from the fight. And that was because you wanted to take a picture. But having just received your camera, you weren't used to using it yet. So you missed the climax of the fight, correct? Yeah. Well, Phoenix, I'll bet Nehemiah will bet you anything he's hiding more than. Hooray. Fight again, huzzah! Ah. Right. Mia means business. Wrong. Or Maya. Your Honor. Nehemiah. The defense would like to request that Cody Hackens testify once more. V very well. Cody, could you please tell us about your camera? How does it take pictures? What does that button do? What's that thing? What's what that? does this What's button that? do? <laughs> What's this do? What's that do? What's this do? What's that do? <laughs> take a picture of the fight. Um. Welcome to the real world, kid. Where the judge asks all the questions. What's this? What's that? What's this? Ooh, what's that? <laughs> no photo? photo? No photo? Yeah, you're right, Pops. The Steel Samurai had just escaped from the clutches of the villain, so I held up my camera to take a picture, but the lens would have opened in time, so I missed it. That's all that happened. Yep. Yep, indeed. Hmm. I need things strange in that testimony, Mr. Wright. I'm not sure, but I'd like to proceed with my cross-examination anyway. We all would. Indeed. Is Edward taking a nap or something? Why is the kid crying? I don't know. Which one are you uh, pressing? The last one. That's all that happened. Yep. Hold it! Hold it. That's all? It, yeah. I, I told you, I didn't take a picture. I would have once I got the lens open. Did he really not take a picture? Not even one? Press him hard. Awkward statement. Nah, he definitely would have taken a picture. There's got to be something here I can use. Cody. Listen up, Cody Hackins. I know exactly what happened that day. You took a picture. Let gasp. Hey. More awesome poses. <laughs> I know, seriously. Bullseye? Question mark? Uh, how did you know? I I'm see through all your Cody. lies, Cody Hackins. I'm your it's father, one of my Cody. powers. Join me. I call it the power of will. Galaxy, father and son. Get it? Wow. The power of will. Will powers. This what? feels great. I'm annoying yes. a kid. Y yeah, yeah, I took a picture. Perhaps you can change your testimony to reflect this, Cody. It's amazing how the kid understands testimonies. Yep. Press the first statement, don't we? 5A, yeah. Uh, I took a few shots, but it was too late, so I erased them. Yep. Hold it. You erase them? Yeah. Why would you erase a picture of your beloved Steel Samurai victorious? Well, well, you know, why would I want to keep a picture like that? He's becoming less and less cooperative. Better find a clear contradiction soon, or some well, solid. Well, we have one. How can I pick holes in such a short testimony? We, there has to be something. There is something. Dig up dirt. Dig, dig up the dirt, Phoenix. Find out what the kid's all about. Anyway, <laughs> go back to that statement. I took a few shots, but I erased them. And present. Oh crap! The path to glory. Objection. Cody. Okay, hold on. Blah, 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 blah. Man, every time you say Cody, it follows with something bad, like whenever my parents call my name. Yep. I just wanted to thank you for giving me this the other day. Huh? Uh, oh, right. Was it you who told me, or what was it? What was it you told me then? I go to every live performance. I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! I got them all. I never missed one. A perfect collection. Cody, did you really get a picture of the Steel Samurai standing victorious over his foe? If you did, I find it hard to believe that you'd just erase it. Wouldn't you keep it for your album? Such uh -huh. a good pose. 
I know, seriously. Mr. Ryan, why don't you have a phone like that? What exactly is this album? It's called. You never heard of an album, Judge? It's a collection of pictures of the Steel Samurai, all taken by Cody Hackett. He claims it's a perfect collection of every battle the Steel Samurai has won. I. I see. Don't you find this very odd, Your Honor? Among all his pictures of the Steel Samurai, none were taken that day. Legash! Slam! Order! Mr. Wright, have you an explanation? Hold on, I am going on recording. If the Steel Samurai had just defeated his adversary, I certainly would expect to see a picture of it in this album. Exactly my point, Your Honor. Triple dots. More triple dots. A lot of dots. No, wait, no way. Yes way. Phoenix. What? I think we finally discovered the truth. Yes, I'm voicing Mia Maya. Yes. And what a truth it is. Kaylee, you should voice Mia. Indeed. Mia, are we sure about this? Did he actually... Yes, he did. Yes. I'm pretty sure what you're thinking is right, Mr. Wright. Ha ha ha. Tell them, Phoenix. Tell them what the truth is. Mr. Wright. What? I'm the judge. Please explain to the court what is going on here. I'm lost, as always. Why was there no picture on the album from the day of the murder? Why would the boy have erased the photos he took? The Steel Samurai didn't, didn't win. win. Epic. I can think of only one reason, Your Honor. The Steel Samurai didn't win. Dun dun dun. That's why Cody deleted those photos. You mean, the Steel Samurai lost? Well, yeah, that would be the flip side <laughs> of not winning. The judge broke into tears. Oh, gosh. <laughs> well, Cody, I'm right, aren't I? <laughs> Tell the truth. The bad guy defeated the Steel Samurai. No, no, no way! No, it's it's impossible. The Steel Samurai never loses. He, he never loses to anyone, ever! Your Honor, this kid is lying. What? And the witnesses revealed everything with his words. There was a reason why he lied and told us he didn't take a picture. The same reason he erased his precious photos. Which is? For Cody, it was inconceivable that the Steel Samurai could be defeated. What? Indeed. However, Cody witnessed the impossible. He saw the Steel Samurai lose. Yet to admit what he saw would destroy everything he believed in. That's why he lied and said the Steel Samurai won. He couldn't handle the truth! <laughs> Dramatic. Hooray. Slam, slam, slam. Order! I will have order. Witness! I mean, Cody, kid, child. Is this true? What did you see? Tell the court what you saw, or else. I. Dot, dot, dot. Bursting into tears. <laughs> nice job, Phoenix. I am such a jerk, and I love it. That's what happened to the judge when he heard the Steel Samurai lost. Exactly. That day you saw the Steel Samurai lose the fight, right? <laughs> okay, okay. You're right. The, the Steel Samurai fell down. The, then he didn't move. <laughs> More crying. I don't feel like doing crying noises right now. Okay. Order! 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 Do it, just Chaos. shut up! What Get kind going. of stunt are you trying to pull, right? The Steel Samurai was the murderer, not the victim. Yet according to your witness's testimony, the Steel Samurai was the one who fell. Dun dun dun. Mr. Samurai, what's going on? I'm still lost. Of course you are. Apparently we've all made a serious error. An error? What's this all about? What do you think it's all about? Steel Samurai was the victim. Dun dun dun. If you understand what really happened, it's actually quite simple. I am. At the end of the fight, the Steel Samurai fell to the ground and lay still. In other words, the Steel Samurai was not the killer. He was the victim, don't you see? Jack Hammer was the Steel Samurai. Well, I could ask. Then... Order! 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 Yes, orders. So the Steel Samurai in this photograph, you're saying is the man in the vi uh, you're saying the man in this costume was the victim, Mr. Jack Hammer? That's what I'm saying, Your Honor. Jack you Hammer was be. present at the action scene run through that morning. Thus he obviously knew about Will Power's foot injury. But but wait! There's more. Had a Mr. Hammer gone to Studio One already? That's what everyone thought. But remember what Miss Obag said in her testimony? Nope. Oh, the beautiful, I mean... Uh, Undertale! The guard station at 1pm. Did I see poor, poor old Hammer? Nope. 
He'd already gone to the studio. I got back before I got back to the guard station. Mr. Jack never left the employee area after lunch. However, no one saw him going to Studio One. Nor was there a picture of him. He waited for Mr. Powers to take a nap in his dressing room. Then he snuck into the dressing room and stole the Steel Samurai costume. I'm a judge. <laughs> but why would the victim do such a thing? I don't know. Because everybody wants to be the Steel Samurai? I get it. The second grader gets it. Of course. <laughs> Everyone else is clueless. I thought the Steel Samurai was moving strange. So it was a different person inside the suit. Pops! Uh, me? What? Actually, there was one place of data I... One piece of data I saved. Data? Data. Yeah, a photo on my digital camera. Awesome. Awesome, Wait, what? awesome. Show us, quick! No way, man. Not if you can look at me like that. Yeah, you tell him. No! <laughs> wow, you're a jerk. He's bringing me. Here, this is it. Well, looking at this, because this is still a little hard to say, I'm afraid that I could be anyone in that costume. Your opinion, Mr. Wright? I agree, Your Honor. This isn't decisive evidence. I'm sorry. This doesn't look like the, the proof we need. I'll give it back. Wait, Phoenix! Right. I love that photo. Give yeah, it to me. what? Go make no, a sandwich. Look at the photo once more. Why? That's it, Phoenix. That photo is all the evidence you need to win this trial. What? Y Your Honor, can I see that photo once more, please? Certainly. I don't see why not. Phoenix, show him. There's a glaring, decisive inconsistency with the facts as we know them in that photo. Oh, oh, oh. Find the inconsistent inconsistency in the photo. I hope you spotted this the first time. It's really, really, really giant. Well, you can actually click on the smaller one too, I think. Get it? The smaller one too? Ha ha! Take that! Your Honor, look at this. I see a gate. Might I draw your attention to the number on that gate? It's a S? Oh, it's the number! Yeah, oh yes, well it's hard to see, but it looks like a two. Clearly not a one, your honor, correct? <laughs> oh, I, I believe have... Mr. Edgeworth sees what I'm getting at, or he just swallowed a fly. But, but, Larry Butts, that's impossible! Of course, Harry Butts. Uh, what's this all about? I'm still lost. <laughs> Please explain so that I might be shocked along with the rest of the courtroom. You're always shocked by everything, Judge, but I'll use the studio guide map anyway. The body was found here in Studio One. However, what do we see in this photo taken at the time of the murder? It does not say one on that gate in the photo. Your Honor, here is the true scene of the crime. Show the judge where the murder took place. That would be right outside Studio Two, isn't it? Well, actually, just anywhere within the Studio Two thing. But... Oh. Yeah. Take that! Here, at Studio 2. I see. That would explain the tool on the gate and the phone. Obviously, it's the dressing room. Your Honor, I find it very significant that the murder took place in Studio 2. But why? The trailer is there. As you may okay. recall, there was a trailer in Studio 2. Now, on that day, a meeting was held in that very trailer. There was a break in the meeting corresponding to the time of death. During that break, Mr. Salmonella and Ms. Steve Vasquez were outside eating steak. They were at the scene of the crime. Dun dun dun. Are you shocked, Stop Judge? Stop talking, people! The path to the trailer was blocked. So we have her. I'm still lost. The path was blocked <laughs> at 2.15. Uh-huh, In other words, the victim went to Studio 2 before that time. Yes. Oh, yes! I suppose that would be the case. Really? He oh, crap! I held down the... Remember uh, Mr. Salmonella's testimony? Allow me to remind the court. He said no one in the trailer was guilty because they could not have gone to Studio One. Yet in actuality, the reverse was true. Only someone in the trailer could have committed the murder. They were the only ones with access to the scene of the crime. Studio Two. <laughs> order, order. The defense makes the following claims. The scene of the crime was Studio Two. The person that the security guard Miss Oldback saw was the victim, Mr. Jack Hammer. 
Mr. Hammer, for some reason, stole a Steel Samurai costume. Then he went to Studio 2. Objection! Objection! This is madness! Don't even Jack think Hammer about it. Jack Hammer is the victim! The victim! Why would he steal a Steel Samurai? Steal a Steel Aha! Uh -huh, steel Samurai costume. Are you suggesting he did so to cover up the details of his own murder? Well, no, of course not. Don't be silly. Mm -hmm. Random judge thinking moment. Yes. <laughs> okay. Or do or do you have proof? Give me proof that the victim, Jack Hammer, stole the costume. I have proof, you fool. You do? You do, Mr. Wright? Does no one believe in me? Now that they're so surprised, suddenly I'm much less confident. I I'm not I'm surprised, right I'm just lost. Here's my proof that Jack <laughs> Hammer stole the costume. And the empty bottle. We can put a fairy in here. Take that! Ooh. This is it. An empty medicine bottle? Oh, well, Looks like mine at home. I found this on the table in the employee area. The same table where Mr. Hammer and Mr. Powers ate. The label reads, Sleeping Pills. How can we never saw it before? Sleeping Pills. What are those? <laughs> I, Karumbo Judge. The defendant, Mr. Powers, spent the entire afternoon sleeping. He was drugged by Mr. Hammer. Where was he drugged to? I don't know. <laughs> Wait a moment. I think I get this now. The bottle does raise some suspicions, yes. But there's no proof that Mr. Hammer used it. Your Honor, I have an idea. I got a really bad idea. Fingerprint the bottle. I got an idea. An idea, you say? Very well, let's hear it. I want to check this bottle for fingerprints. If my claim is true, Mr. Hammer's fingerprints should show up on this bottle. Mm -hmm. I suppose you're right. Very well, the court will take possession of the bottle. Empty like bottle given to the judge. Yay! Mine. Da 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 da! You got a bottle. The court will suspend proceedings on the current trial for today. Cody Hackett's testimony has revealed new possibilities in this case. In fact, things may have happened very differently than we previously thought. The Steel Samurai, seen by Miss Oldbag, may have been the victim, Jack Hammer. The scene of the crime was not Studio 1, but Studio 2. And those in the trailer did have time to commit the murder. Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor? Hi. Hello. Your your homework is to find the answer to the following question. What is my name? The oh. The Judge. Yes. Hammer still the Seal Samurai caution. Also, who killed him and why? Find the answer for me by tomorrow and Should you will get to the murder first though. But that's a lot of homework. I don't want to burn I didn't it now. Study. I want I want pizza, Mr. Edgeworth. Get me pizza. Huh. Get me pizza. You will need to reconsider your stance in this case. Above all, you will need to reconsider your suspicion of Mr. Will Powers, as you say, Your Honor. This draw will be extended until tomorrow. This is the last extension of my hair. Yay. Hair extensions. Very well. Course adjourned. Beard I'm going for pizza. Who wants to join me? Me. Too bad. Aww. Loser. You have work. You have homework. It can wait. October 9th. Yep. October 19th, 2.47 p.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby, number one. That was a close one. We were saved by a hair because the judge talked about ex But that's all that counts. I thought seriously about going home about three times during the trial. Gee, You're dead. thanks for your confidence in me. <laughs> You're me dead. Me too. Wow, even I have great confidence. But really? Yes. You both seem so, so confident. <laughs> Maybe I should take a career in acting. I was ready to pronounce you dead about three times back there. Me too! We all thought you did it! D dead <laughs> Of course! Oh, we're kidding. No, we're not. <laughs> Are you sure? Not really. I wasn't kidding. Now, Mr. Powers, we have to go make our final investigation. But I promise you we'll find the true killer by tomorrow's trial. Uh, right, it, thanks. To be continued. Well, that was a lot of lots. I did not think that would take very long, but it took 49 minutes. Yeah, I didn't think that would take that long either. Oh, well. Hey, caramba. Hey, uh, so, 
we thank you all for watching. We also feel sorry for each and every one of you for watching. Next time, it'll still be October 19th. What a shock. At least it's not and the 18th anymore. Exactly. We'll find out what the judge has to say about this whole, whole trial and see if he ever gets a bearing on it. And what kind of pizza he ate. I know. So, we will see you next time. I'm Cabral. I have been Cabral95. You have been, of course. And I, I will be Chip Skylark. Of course. And we will see you next time. See ya. Later.